Can you tell which of these children was not born free? Can you tell which of these children was not born equal? Can you tell which of these children does not deserve to be treated with dignity? We can't either. Human right number one. We are all born free and equal. What are human rights? Find out at youthforhumanrights.org. greeted you at birth. It was there for your first step. Your first mistake. Your first kiss. It's with you when you win. When you lose. When you pick yourself up again. In every moment, you can feel it. Life. Human right number three, the right to life. What are human rights? Find out at youthforhumanrights.org. Okay, kids, here we are at the slavery exhibit. Now, as you can see, the slaves were kidnapped from their homes, chained together for weeks. They would cram them onto these ships in very appalling conditions. Thousands of women and children are being smuggled across the border. Sexual trafficking of children. And as you can see right here, they were treated like animals. They worked all day long for no pay. In sweatshops raided by police, children forced into slave labor. Some of the slave masters were very cruel. They whipped them and they beat them, as you can see in some of these pictures. Torture and assault. Well, brutal, even fatal. So, before moving on, are there any questions? Um, does this still happen today? When I was walking home from school, they asked me for my money. I said no. And all my friends ran home because they were scared he might punch them too. I was screaming, but he just wouldn't stop. He always said he would hit me. I just didn't think he actually would. I don't know what I did, but they just kept on kicking me. They tied me up and dragged me outside. They stripped me of my dignity. She said she was going to teach me a lesson. He said I wasn't listening. 
I didn't think you'd get so mad. Different words describe different people. But in the eyes of the law, there's one that fits us all. Human right number seven. We're all equal before the law. What are human rights? Find out at youthforhumanrights.org. about human rights for those that don't know you need to yo a starving artist but his lyrics so worldwide his friend and manager was a snake in the sky then he was bitten his song sold without his permission saw his record on the shelf the snake had stolen his vision but knowing his rights he could protect himself fair treatment by fair course he got the law to help the other dude just sunk weak looked like a punk could hardly open his mouth and speak popping that jump you better get up stand up if you've been done wrong you better stand up for your rights like that Molly song get yourself represented Lawfully defend it, know your human rights, don't ever surrender, no, don't ever surrender, yeah. Somebody just tell me. Gosh, just talk to somebody. <laughs> Let me go. People versus Martin White. Mr. White has been charged with guilty. Next case. But Geronic, you, you haven't heard the charges yet. Guilty. Next case. Guilty. 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 I have been present. Guilty. Next case. Stealing my thing. I wouldn't have to raise my voice if you just give it back and stop 
being like a criminal. I don't have your cell phone. Oh God, I don't have look your cell at yourself. Phone. What are you offering? Is this a home? thief's uniform? Oh my God. You see all oh. these people standing around here? Oh. Why am oh. I the one? I I'm Why sorry, are you homie. Right okay. <laughs> what? Don't make this a big deal. Just give it back, okay? Did you see me? Did yeah, you see you me? know, I just know you took it. Where are your witnesses? Look at Where are your witnesses? Did you see me? Did you see me? You left us in the bathroom. I'm Chinese. I am Russian. I am East African. I'm Canadian. I am Filipina. I am Irish. I am Bulgarian. Korean. I am American. I am Brazilian. Italian. Mexican. I'm British. Swedish. French. I'm Israeli. Mongolian. I'm Sada. Japanese. We are mankind. She came up and kissed me one day. It was an impulse. I just grabbed him and I kissed him on the lips and I ran away. Because I was like 20 years old. It's not like something you talk about marriage all the time. But I asked for her number. She wouldn't give me her number. No, I think he liked me first for sure because... She's hot. We met in a grocery store. We were in a class together. Came up to me one day and says, I got this perfect girl for you. He was a good dancer but not too good. Like he was my soulmate. She's my queen. Of course, I'm the king. <laughs> I said, I have to ask you something, and she, and she said, what? And I kneeled down, and she was laughing and trembling. She gets so embarrassed. What did I say? I said, will you marry me or will you be my wife? Will you be my wife? He proposed to me on my birthday. And she said, yes. Are you sure? 
<laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I believe in nature. I believe in the spirit. I believe in trust. Beauty. I believe in my mom. Strawberry ice cream. Fortune cookies. Chocolate. I believe in the tooth fairy. Being honest with yourself. I believe in Santa Claus. Aliens, of course. I believe what I want to believe. I believe in myself. I believe in myself. I believe in peace.
mistake. I am more than this. Seems okay to me, kid. Maybe you should check your math. <laughs> hey there. Hey, boss. Let's see what you got. Maybe you should check yours. According to estimates, over one billion people live in appalling levels of poverty. Denied even basic standards of food, water. Nearly half of the world's population earns less than... Krista, make sure you stay with her the whole time. She's new to the country. This is her Mom. first day. This Mom. is a brand Mom. new country. Mom. It's a whole different it's culture. Be okay. Now make sure you stay with her the whole time. I'll be here right okay. after school to pick you up. Okay, Mom. Okay, have fun. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. Ignore my mom. She's so annoying. She's totally freaking out about this whole thing. She freaks out about everything. She always does that. Ugh. Ignore my mom. So, you ready for your first day in the wicked castle of doom? I mean, like, seriously. So boring. I don't know how they could put us through this like every single day. How many schools do you have in your village? None. Dude. <laughs> this is pirated. So? So, I wanted the real thing. What's the difference, man? The difference? So when I start making movies, people ripping me off. <laughs> I wouldn't rip you off, man. Prove it. The world I see is fair and free, where people can travel wherever they please. And children can eat and have shoes on their feet and not be afraid when they walk on the street. It's not like there has to be rainbows and bunnies. The streets full of people are dancing like dummies. But freedom to live, to learn, and to play, to just be yourself and think your own way. The road I see may sound crazy to you, but hopefully, someday, you'll see it too. Good morning. 
morning. I'm here to read you your rights. My what? We are all free and equal. Don't discriminate. You have the right to life. You have the right to life. And to live in freedom and safety. You have a right to education. You have a right to your own things. You have the right to social security. You have the right to play. You have the right to democracy. You have the right to asylum. You have the right to take responsibility. And no one and nobody can take these rights and freedoms away from you. Why are you doing this? You have a right to know. These are your human rights. There are 30 of them. They belong to you. You don't have to buy them, or apply for them, or ask permission to have them. They're just yours. No matter who you are, where you're from, how old you are, or anything else, it's just that simple. Now some people may try to ignore your rights, or violate them, or pretend they don't exist. But they can't change the fact that they are yours. Human right number 30. No one can take away your human rights. What are human rights? Find out at youthforhumanrights.org.